Hi and welcome to Little Hatchlings Art Lessons. Today we're going to be drawing Marshall. Wait, Marshall from what? Paw Patrol. Yeah, Marshall from Paw oh, Patrol. Hey, this red pants. Oh, red. Cause why? Do, why do we need red? For his poo buddy. For his vest and for his hat. Huh. Okay. Let's get started. Let's get started. Mm -hmm. yeah. We're gonna start with his nose, like we did with the other pups. Right here? Mm hmm. So you make yeah, a curved line. And Is this you... big enough? Mm hmm. And then you make a reflection inside there. It's that's... a big one. I'm going to do something different. Like. So yeah, you leave a reflection in there. Because this is this a reflection? Mm hmm. I did the word wrong. That's it's... okay. All right, so now instead of the rainbow being above the nose on Marshall, it goes right with the nose like that. Why? He's just a different dog than the other dogs. He's a Dalmatian. I want to do it like shape. Well, this is how I'm drawing Marshall. Can you? It's, it's because it's my picture. I can do what I want. Okay, and then we're going to do a little. He's on the side, look. <laughs> so a little line down, and then Ooh. his smile is going to be open. Um, so I'm doing a curved smile like that. Oh, my line needs to be a little longer. It has a tongue. Yeah. I like doing the tongue. So the way, I do a tongue too? Yeah, so the way you're going to do the tongue is you're going to make this. Glad I didn't do a tongue to Ryder. Yeah. So we're going to do cur two curved little lines. and then I didn't get my... And then it comes Mouth together open. down there. Cute. And then we're gonna make a line going back up to there. And then another line going back up to there. And then. Are we gonna color it in? Yeah, this part's gonna be filled in black above the tongue. But not the tongue. That's right. And don't forget these two cute little. <laughs> Okay. Okay. So now we're going to put some little freckles. Oh, hands. Yeah, you were pushing hard on <laughs> filling that in, huh? So some little freckles inside of, like, right next to the nose. Can you do that, babe? Yeah. Okay, do some little freckles. Is it making it sharp? Is it still sharp? Totally, yeah. I want to do more than that. One, two, three. We get mine. Sure. How many of it? That's a ton. <laughs> How many? I don't know. I'll count while you're doing the other side. So you have 13 on this side. <laughs> and how many on this one? 15. All right. Yeah. So now we need to do his eyes. So we're going to make the this rainbow. Three more than 13. Rainbow shape and then. But that was over. too big. This is perfect. I'm doing it right. I'm wondering. So, do it rainbow different. shape, like I said. And then. Oh, you gotta hold on to your paper so that it doesn't move on you. Okay. And then we're gonna draw a big circle on the inside. And he's got blue eyes. Why? But what about red eyes? Well, that would be a scary dog if he had red eyes. Oh, then he'll be like a demon dog. What's a demon dog? Like a bad one. Can I do that one? <laughs> no, then it'll be scary. Okay, I'm so. I do scary. <laughs> because it's my picture. Mm -hmm. Okay, well, we'll color later. Okay, <laughs> now we gotta do his other eye with the. I already did. Wow, good job. And then I'm gonna do this and the highlight. Good job. Then a circle. Yep, a circle. Then a the highlight. And then the big black part called the pupil. Can you fill in your black pupil? Uh, right here? Mm-hmm. Like this? Yeah, that looks better. And then I'm going to do black red eyes. <laughs> Later. Okay, <laughs> so now we're going to do his fire hat. 
So we're gonna. What's the fire hat? We're gonna start over here. Wait. And it kind of goes just right above his eyes. That is wrong. <laughs> a fire hat is wrong. Actually. Can you draw that line? But how long? I wanna do how long? Good. And then it kind of angles up. It and is then, curvy. Yeah, you follow that. Oh, right now I'm drawing the brim. I'm going to do the brim. Okay. <laughs> Cute. And then from the brim, I'm going to make this shield. This is kind of like a fireman's hat. You go diagonal up mm -hmm, and then curve it up. It's like a diamond. And then curve it down and then curve it out that way and then down. And then you can put the Paw Patrol symbol in there. I want to do it later. So we're going to draw a curved line right there um, and then angle it in and then angle that in and then down. Look at the skirt! To a point. Look at the skirt! Oh cute. Yeah, there's a little, a little um, knob at the top. Good job. And we got to draw the paw right here and then the three ovals and then I'm gonna draw the outline around this awesome wow that paw is not very good there we go <laughs> no I problem I don't have any room for my paw oh you can just do dots do, do, do. or just leave it up it's down for the toes. Mm hmm And then a circle for the mouth. Good job. All right. And now there's a yellow. That one is, like, hiding because that was a good one. Oh. So there's a yellow stripe right here and another yellow stripe right here. Um, and then from we here, have to do some more stripes? it curves up and goes behind that knob. And then it curves down this way. Oh, I don't have any room for the body. And then there's like a little flashlight right here. Okay. Um, Look, he has a flashlight. Uh, it's round. Why? He has a flashlight so that when firefighters go into dark places, they can still see. Okay, and then his eyebrows kind of show I under. I don't want to. No worries. All right, so his eyebrows kind of show right here. I made it bigger. Oh, good idea. So now we need to do the side of his head. So look at this. You just kind okay, of Okay, I'm going to do the flashlight. I'm going to do the flashlight. Okay. All right, so now curve down just a little bit. I didn't know. And then his cheek comes out. Okay, only I'm going to do the face. And then down to his tongue. Okay, and then behind down. the tongue. Okay, now let me come to this side of the tongue. Uh -huh. So behind is the chin, it goes up and then out for his jaw, and then up, and then it curves up like that. Um, Mom, now we need to do his ears. I didn't. He's got cute Dalmatian ears. Mom, I'm not going to do the body. You're not going to have room for his body, unless you do a really itty bitty one. <laughs> I want to. Okay, watch. So okay, let's do his ears. So start right here. Under the shack. Yep. And then it curves out uh, a little bit. And then Why down. Why can't he just be like that? He's a Dalmatian. Is and then they go up I'm gonna... and over behind. And then there's Look a, at here. Yeah. And then there's a little portion that's a diagonal line right yeah. here. Yeah. And it's gonna be pink right here. Okay, so now I need to do it over here. So I'm it comes gonna do down. The pink to a point and then it go, angles up kind of like a triangle and then goes behind I'm the I'm gonna hat. do the red on in his eyes right now. Not right now. Okay, so then there's that diagonal line. Oh, wait, we have to do the spots. He's a Dalmatian, he has spots. And they're not like regular polka dots. They're kind of like... They're, he's they're a different. fire dog. Yeah, those are Dalmatians. So that's two of his spots right there. They're kind of like flatty and like mm -hmm. circle-y. Mm -hmm. well, this one's like a circle, like a polka dot up here. I want to look. That hides behind the hat. I'm going to do polka dots all over my picture. Really? But not right now. I'm <sighs> tired. Oh. 
And then here's another splotch. Uh, I guess they could be called splotches instead of spots, huh? No, they're circles too. Okay. And then over here, yep, splotches. here's another circle. There's some like this, right? Mm -hmm. Like this. Sure. Some fairy do dogs have some of normal circles. Hmm. Right? Yeah, maybe. I saw some okay, I'm done because there's a oh, lot. Oh, I need else. to have mine go out a little bit more. Okay, now yeah. can I teach how to draw the body? Can you draw a collar? Okay, so we're gonna draw two lines down and she doesn't wanna draw the body, so that's fine. You guys can just watch mine. And then here's the collar. And then we're gonna draw his vest symbol. So you draw a line over and then down. It's kind of like the Paw Patrol symbol, but just a little different. It's kind of like an arrowhead. And then you can draw an outline around it. So we're gonna finish our outline around this. And then there's flames in this one, because he's a fire dog. So we're gonna draw flames in there. And then we're gonna draw his vest. But first we have to draw his shoulders coming down on either side. And then it follows down. And then we're gonna pause right there because we need to draw his paws. <laughs> So here's one paw, and then we're gonna skip over a little bit and draw his other paw, and then bring them together. Ooh, one of my paws was bigger than the other, but that's okay. And then you're gonna do two curved lines that go towards each other. And then you can draw the bottom part of his vest. And then the side part of his vest too. And then his leg goes straight down. And this side goes straight down. And then his knees, one comes out and down. And then we've got that same shape for his toe right there. And then the same shape right there for his other toe. And then we can draw a spot right here and another spot right here. And then a big spot right here. Then a little spot right here. And then a rainbow shape right here coming down. And then his toe. And then coming back in one more rainbow shape for his other toe and then one more spot and that is it for Marshall. We hope you had so much fun drawing with us. We colored ours on the iPad and you can pause it and use this as an example to help you know where to put the different colors and I would love to see how yours turns out. So feel free to take a picture of it and have one of your parents tag me at Sarah Hatch Art Studio on Instagram and then I can see it. Make sure you subscribe to our channel so you don't miss our future videos and we'll see you next time.